I'm Jared Hillam. I want you to imagine that you decided to write the word chicken in a date field. Imagine what that would do to reports that were aggregated by month. The word chicken would completely mess up the use of the data. For relational databases, there are basic rules that govern the format of the data. Date, for example, has its own format. You literally can't write the word chicken in a date data type. The database will throw back an error and say that it isn't a recognized format for that field. SQL databases will have data types for numeric, dates and times, binary data, logical switches, structured data, and other specialized types. When a column has a data type specified, then it comes with rules for how data can be written. So if we use the date data type as an example, the date information must be, you know, YYY-MM-DD or some kind of format for dates. Now, just because the databases create barriers for entering bad data, it doesn't mean that dirty data can't sneak in. The data type consistency, which is the C in ACID, simply sets up low level rules, but the incorrect data can still be entered. For example, you could still fat finger the wrong date in, but you won't be able to write the word chicken into the date field and be able to save the record. Now in our next video on ACID compliance, we're going to cover isolation. So we'll see you over there.